What's good YouTube, Jermaine, welcome back to another video. Just thought I'd document a case study of a recent model that we brought on only a couple of months ago now on uh, our scale on to around 27, 28K per month, around top 04, 039% of, of a creator. We did this just through one traffic source only. And it's quite an interesting traffic source because as you guys can see through the recent videos that I posted on YouTube, we've used multiple traffic sources for our models. I'm not really a fan of just leveraging one just because you put all your eggs in one basket, it tends to bite you in the ass. But this model just took off really well on this traffic source and we thought we just would stick with it and scale it as much as humanly possible. So I'm gonna throw some views up on the screen so you guys can see. But this is this was through Instagram Reels, right? So we mainly just focus on Instagram Reels and we did this across a multitude of accounts. I'm gonna show you some screenshots and some results that you guys can see. Like we are hitting millions upon millions of views every single week for this model. Like you can see we're hitting 911K, 910K, 1.4 mil, 1.3 mil, 1.4 two mil like continuously hidden m's for this model um, on our instagram accounts and these are as you can see targeted non-followers so it's continuously getting pushed in the algorithm okay and it's continuously getting shown to new audiences every single day every single day every single day we did this through multiple different angles how we're doing this is we're scaling multiple instagram accounts and per phone we're using good high quality iphone iphone x and above we're basically using this across three accounts three to four instagram accounts per one iPhone and we have multiple iPhones running for this one model at this point. Now we're using a good mixture of authentic content. Model is filming and then we're repurposing and re-editing in app on each Instagram account directly. We are doing a level of repurposing, but it's mainly coming from good quality content. If the good quality content isn't performing well in app on the first phone, on the first account, if the main quality content isn't performing the best on the first account, then the rest just isn't gonna perform as well. So we're only re-editing and repurposing videos that are already doing 70, 80, 90K views um, in, in the USA market. Otherwise, they're not just gonna do it. They're not gonna do as well on a repurposed account. So that's a key golden nugget for you guys. We're only really repurposing content that is already getting good proof of concept already. We're then just repurposing, re-editing, adding different captions. And there's multiple different ways that you can re-edit in-app on Instagram to kind of show it as fresh metadata, right? As fresh content for the Instagram algorithm. But that is just a few ways on how we're doing it. Re-editing, shortening the video, zooming in, zooming out, adding captions, adding different sounds, adding filters, like five different ways you guys can use to basically re-edit your videos on Instagram directly. Okay, now that times a good strategy coming in through the OF account itself. Obviously, subscriber revenue is a tiny, tiny percentage of the case study. Messaging and tips and good chatting, high quality chatting is also very, very important on how we're generating um, the, the revenue through the subs. So I would always, always, always suggest freestyling works best. And then just you're sending mass PPVs to everyone, you're gonna find yourself just continuously losing fans. Your retention rate is gonna be super super low so what we're doing heavily is focusing on building good rapport good relationship and deep relationships with every single fan that comes through the door of course not every single fan is going to respond not every single fan is going to reply but the ones that are replying we're actually going out of our way to make a conscious effort and pricing our videos and our content at a much higher rate building in that good authority from the model we times that and that over time we times that with some scripts the scripts aren't mass ppv scripts or anything like that we basically tee up the fans for certain scenarios example we will do a house cleaning script house cleaning script would be the model cleaning the house as normal okay and then it then turns sexual turns into base and then turns into you know role play type content that absolutely crushes it for us we have like 70 to 80 different scripts that we built internally at the agency and we run our models through those different scripts every single day on the account so when a fan comes through the door like you're seeing on this case right here like we're getting millions upon millions of views um per week per month that translates into hundreds of subs per month. Now those hundreds of subs, how are you monetizing off that? Scripts and freestyle and chatting is absolutely key. That is exactly how we're generating that, that kind of revenue that's coming from. Now this has only been two, three months working with this model. This is only gonna increase over the next few weeks, I can imagine. Like these numbers, as you saw, um, were over the last kind of 30 days of June, July. So August, September is just only gonna compound. And especially we're building more and more accounts every single day, every single day. And we're probably adding like three to six accounts every single day to that model's profile. You can imagine if when those start to take off, and I will say IG Reels does take a long
longer to take off than TikTok used to, for instance. I do feel, looking at the market, we are at where TikTok was in like 2020. We are at where TikTok was in the OFM space around 21, 22 space, right? So you can post good quality content on TikTok. It will get good views. We're kind of at that place with IG Reels. Maybe a little bit later, to be fair. It's getting harder. But as you guys can see, this is literally the last 30 days worth of results. And um, it, it's doing incredibly well. I will say though, you do need to get creative. You do, do need to add good different hooks, different ways to stop guys from scrolling on their for you page on the IG Reels section. Um, and I've noticed that's massively, massively improved our, our view count for these videos that the model is obviously doing. So multiplying good content ideas. Okay, we're only posting one to two times per day on each IG Reel account. We're not going crazy. But as you can imagine, we have 15, 20 plus IG Reel accounts. As you can imagine, we have 30 to 40 IG Reels accounts for this model and we're increasing, increasing every single day. Like we're now increasing the scale of how much we're doing this because we're seeing good proof of concept with this particular model. So that's basically what we're doing on the traffic front and then we're monetizing the traffic through good quality chatting, okay, good quality report building, building scripts, good quality chatting on the accounts, okay, making sure our chatters are going deep, meaningful connections, building good rapport, understanding exactly what the fan wants, selling at a premium, selling at a high price, and then running scripts based off real life scenarios so that guys and the fans actually feel like they're there with the model currently right now. And I've noticed that has definitely helped increase our conversion rates through PPV selling. So hopefully that makes sense, guys. Like, again, this is me more just documenting some of the results that we get in. Like for newer models, it's more interesting because um, I know we get models applied to where us every single week. Like these are kind of expectations of results that we've been hitting. So you guys can kind of see that if you are a model watching this. And if you are a model watching this, go ahead, click the link below if you are looking to join an agency. If we can't take you on right now, I have a bunch of students, one-to-one -one students that we directly partner with that can definitely help scale you. So if you're interested, go ahead, apply on the link below. There's going to be a create application form and uh, look forward to hearing from you guys. But yeah, guys, this is me just documenting again another case study that we achieved. I expect this model to hit 0.2, 0.3% in the next month or so, if not less. So hopefully you guys are all well. Like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy my content. Peace out and I'll see you in the next one.